Yo. <laughs> Yo. I'm scared this morning. <laughs> Yo, my name is Don. Sam here. We are the Soul Brothers and we're creating a video for you to watch. Yep. On your tablet or device or computer. We're gonna have a little chit chat right now. Let's talk about some big stuff in the NBA right now. Yep. It's been kind of a crazy year so far. Uh, season's wrapping up. A lot of crazy stuff happening. Kobe is having his last game. Yep. I'm gonna shed a tear real quick. That's my guy. <laughs> yeah. I love Kobe, man. Uh, but another crazy thing is uh, as we're filming this, the uh, Warriors have just tied the Bulls record. 72 and 9? 72. Well, they, they haven't uh, they haven't tied it. It's 72 and 9. Mm -hmm. So the Bulls are 72 and 10. Yeah. So, they're better. so if they lose tomorrow, they tied it. Yeah. But then they're going to win tomorrow. Who are they playing tomorrow? I don't even know. They're probably going to win. But they're probably going to win because they just beat the Spurs. Yeah, at home. At home, pretty yeah. handily. Shut down their home winning streak. Yep. <laughs> um, yeah. But this is crazy. I mean, the Warriors are... Um, you think about out of 80 games, losing nine times. Yeah. Think about that. That's, that's, and that's the, crazy. And the games they lost were like really fucking stupid. They lost to like the Lakers, worst teams. The Lakers. The, the Lakers. The Bucks. I think they it's lost like, to the Celtics. Yeah. I'm just like, um, oh, yeah Celtics these, are yeah. so-so, but um, they also lost to like, I think they lost to the 76ers. <laughs> it, like, correct me if I'm wrong. That's crazy. Yeah. And they got blown out too, but a lot of those games were like, uh, 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 like three the game road, road exactly. trips. Yeah, the you know, they're game, tired. Yeah. They're burnt out. A lot of the games, either, you know, Steph Curry was just off. Which happens, you know what I mean? Yeah. He's the best player in the league right now, but every, everybody has their off nights. Don't don't say that because you're going to offend some people. Nah, I speak the truth, man. <laughs> I, you know, they could deal with, however, with that however they want to, but yeah. that's my opinion. But, you know, so this is crazy. I mean, we're about, we're, you know, it's a historic season for it sure is. for the Warriors. I, I, I want to watch a game. Yeah. But, um, yeah, I, do you think they're going to win the championship? I do. Yeah. They I do. I mean, you know, yeah. how, how could you not? How could you not with the 70, 72 and 9? Right? Yeah, it's, it's, it's tough to, yeah. to bet against them. I mean, yeah. I don't see many teams that can beat them aside from the Spurs. Um, and, you know, that's going to be a good series if they wind up meeting each other in the playoffs. The finals. finals. Yeah. Or, or the conference finals or whatever. And yeah. So, yeah, I mean, it's just an awesome, awesome season to watch. You know, if, you, if you're into greatness and watching greatness, you know, I'm not by no means a Warriors fan at all. Um, and bad wagon, I don't really like that term. Uh, you're witnessing greatness, and who doesn't want to see that? Exactly. You know what I mean? Uh, everybody should be watching. Mm -hmm. um, you know, you're watching one of the best seasons a player's had ever. Curry, mm -hmm. breaking all kinds of records. Yep. And then the team is breaking records. And I think uh, some of the other teammates are breaking records. Yeah. Draymond Green is breaking records. Um, a few as Clay far Thompson. as triple doubles and shit I think yeah. Clay Thompson is breaking records uh, he had the highest scoring quarter in the history of the game was that this year or last year? I think it was, it was this year, year. Or is this yeah. year? Oh. well I mean last year but this season yeah I thought it was last season no oh, okay. that was this season okay. uh, correct me if I'm wrong but I, I'm 90% is this season okay. 37 points in a quarter yeah that's nuts um, so you know we are big time basketball fans as far as we love playing basketball um, I'm a big NBA fan too. However, I don't like have a league pass and I, I don't watch every single game. I don't watch that much. He doesn't actually. watch that much at all. Um, I just like to play. He just likes to play, which is totally understandable. But uh, once the playoffs come, you're probably going to want to watch. Yeah, definitely. The playoffs are. are I'm be definitely crazy. watching the finals though. Yeah. Oh yeah, the finals for sure. Um, and you know. And and did you know that uh, you know Kobe's last game? is more expensive than the finals game versus um, the Lakers and Celtics. Wow. So the finals last, uh, Kobe's last game is like one, the ticket price is like 1,600 or something. Damn. And then the Lakers versus Celtics finals, uh, the ticket price for that was like 1,200 or something. I'm gonna be sad, dude. Like, I'm really sad about that. It's crazy. Why it's though? Like, he sucks now. I don't wanna watch no, him. No, I know he, he does, but yeah. like, um, you know, it's just sad because it's like it's weird it's one of those weird things like i don't really care about kobe i don't yeah. know him yeah right he's not my family he, none of that stuff but it's just a part of my life that i've grown accustomed to throughout the years it's just watching him play and the entertainment i get from that and the fact that that's gone is is just kind of uh 
it's kind of sad you know what i mean yeah. it just is you know humans get very attached to shit you know humans get attached to cars you know you sell your car you've had forever you're like yeah. oh my car you know it's, yeah. that's an inanimate object yeah so you know i really don't care about kobe as you know i, I don't he, i don't know him i've never met him you know how could i really care about him as a person yeah like that but i i do love watching him play and 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 all that so it's really kind of sad mm -hmm. you know and, and just to see that just to know that someone so great has to give that up yeah and it has to be done I wish just because of father time yeah i wish you could stay young forever and yeah. see who the best would be and shit i always think about that what if like no one ever got old like what would happen? The, game, you, they, the league would just be filled with like Jordan, Kobe, yeah. LeBron, like forever. forever. Like you know, and all the mediocre players would like no, they wouldn't even last a season. Yeah, they'd be in for one season and then you'd be gone. Yeah, it'd be the cream of the crop. You That'd know, be awesome. That would be crazy. You know, you'd have players like you know I don't even know. And then you just get better and better every year. Better and better every year. You, you can know? stay young. And, but um, there's always this question where like it's like. There's always this question where it's like, who's the better player and shit? You know, like Michael Jordan, Kobe, Steph Curry, LeBron James, and shit like that. Yeah. Um, what do you think? I think that, I think two things. I think number one, the skill level in the game right now is far beyond what it used to be. Yeah. And I, you know, I might get flack for that, but that's my opinion. <laughs> I've Keep in mind, I watched Jordan play live. Not live, but like on TV. I grew up with that. <laughs> yeah. You know what I mean? And the Lakers, Showtime Lakers. Um, I've watched Kobe since he was a rookie. So I go back, you know what I mean? Like watching real basketball, you know, uh, in the moment of when they were in their prime, before they were in their prime. I mean, Kobe. And I've watched Jordan in his prime. The skill level right now, some of the stuff you're seeing, like with Steph Curry. You see these and, like elite. And the athleticism. Yeah. Elite point guards are fucking crazy. And they're short as shit. bananas, dude. You know, like I think... I think Michael Jordan would, he'd still be really good, but if he was in the league right now, he would be just like, I don't know. I See, I don't think, I, I think that I Michael know. Jordan, I think, see, the game of basketball is mostly mental, okay? Because, like, it, a lot of it's physical, but a lot of it comes down to, like, just making the shot. Yeah. Right? You're, you're A lot of times you're open or you have somewhat of a shot. Can you make the shot? And Jordan was so possessed that he would just make the shots mm. that needed to be made right and colby was a lot like that another thing i wanted to say is that at the same note as this i think the skill level all the way around so you're talking about better um better athletic programs better technology better shoes better shoes um better um not a medical advance medical uh techniques all that stuff nutrition, surgeries nutrition and acl i mean back in the years ago you got an acl injury you're done you're done yeah call it quits dog now you got an acl injury and i guess you still got to call it quits look at d rose <laughs> <you're right? laughs> that's no. so sad though. that's sad <laughs> that's that is sad yeah. but okay but at the same note as i think the skill level has increased by a lot i think the physicality has gotten a lot less right yeah just because the way the NBA is calling it, the officials, you know, you can't even like look at somebody after you dunk on them. <laughs> yeah. Back when I was a kid, like people would dunk and then push the other guy yeah. and like walk down the court and it was just part of the game. Yeah. You know, people throwing elbows, you fights all the time. Yeah. And that's just the way it was. But there are a lot more friendships and shit. Yeah. You know, and back then it was like, yeah, there was a lot more rival, like real yeah. rivalries. Yeah. There's really no crazy rivalries right yeah. now. Just like everyone's chill with each other, which, yeah. is, which is chill, but which is cool. It's like kind of a better way to be as a person, probably. Yeah. But it's not as fun to watch, of course. Exactly. You know, watching, uh, watching the Bulls versus the Jazz was just insane. Yeah. They fucking hated each other. Yeah. Or, or you know, the Bulls versus the Pistons. You know, oh, yeah. it, it was it was or Lakers versus the Celtics back in the day. Mm -hmm. So we don't really have any rivalries like that. But hey, we're just shooting the shit here. Um, that's some of our thoughts on the NBA right now. Again, like we said, we're not like uh, dot, we're not nuts. So I'm not watching every game, but we we want to chime in with our opinions a little bit because we do know a little bit, and uh, and uh, I'm sure you guys are interested in in what's going on right now too in the NBA. But um, so we'll see you guys tomorrow. We're just uh, kind of hollering at you guys. My name is Don. Family here. We are the Soul Brothers. Later. Peace.